and welcome if you are new to my channel please click on the subscribe button. Today we are going to do a quick review about the foundation stick from Sugar Cosmetics. So this is the Ace of Face foundation stick from Sugar Cosmetics and this is of shade 47 Borgia. Today let us do a quick review about this foundation, about the shade and the finish. And this foundation is something which I did a lot of research and I got this foundation because one main thing is the shade range. It is, uh, there is a lot of shades available, but it is mostly out of stock. The light shades are always available, but the darker shades uh, is definitely not uh, really easy to get. And uh, this shade, especially 47 Borgia, is something which I really did not find it at all. Uh, finally, it was in stock in the Sugar Cosmetics website and I got it. There are various other shades as well, uh, you know, which is similar to this, but it is too difficult to figure out which shade actually suits your skin. Uh, there is also 48 Irish and, uh, you know, 50 and also 45 Compana. So I had a really huge dilemma about which shade to select. Uh, but however, I got this shade 47 Borgia, which is really great. So mine is a medium to deep skin tone and this shade went on really well. So today, let's see how good this foundation is. So this is the foundation stick. Uh, this is how the foundation is. It also comes with this inbuilt brush. So this brush is not really great. It doesn't, you know, help you to blend in very quickly. But anyways, let's go ahead and try the uh, brush as well today. So I'll just use one side for now and I'll use this brush to blend in just to show you how it blends. So it definitely blends in well, but uh, you know, it's a, uh, you know, it's a time taking uh, process because the brush is too small. So it's a creamy texture, uh, it is blending in uh, very well and it is giving a pretty good coverage as you can see here. So this is more like a warm toned shade. So you can see the difference here, it's giving you a pretty good coverage. So this is a very easy to use foundation. So if you're traveling, uh, you know, this is a really great foundation to carry. Now I'll use a blending brush to blend it. So it is definitely easier with the brush rather than the inbuilt brush, which they have. I feel it's giving you a better finish with this brush. So here it's not really blended in well. You can see the difference. I'll just blend out the whole face with this brush. So this is the finish you get with the foundation stick from uh, Sugar Cosmetics and I really love the finish. It's giving you a nice matte finish which is a really great for oily skin people. A little quantity is more than sufficient. You can actually build it up by applying more as well. And this shade uh, 47 Borgia is really good. I really loved it. It's suiting my skin very beautifully. I'm not sure about the other shades, how different uh, is the previous shade and the next shade, but this shade is really good. I really liked it. I will give a closer look to uh, uh, show you how the finish is. You can see here it's giving a pretty good coverage and it's covering the blemishes very well. And I have used this foundation a couple of times. It definitely lasts for quite some time. I've used it at least for five to six hours and it stays on, it doesn't leave your face oily. So I set it up with a good compact or a setting powder. And coming to the packaging, so the packaging is really great. It is good for traveling purpose. It is initially creamy, but it gives you a matte finish. You can see here that. And the inbuilt brush, which comes with this is not really that great. Uh, you know, if you're using a very less quantity and blending in, 
uh, I think uh, it, it's okay. But otherwise, if you blend it in hand, it will be more than sufficient rather than using the inbuilt brush is what I feel. So that's a quick review about the Sugar Cosmetics Ace of Face Foundation Stick. I hope this was useful and you liked it. If you like it, please click on like and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching and have a great day ahead.